Buffalo is the common name for bison in North America. This powerful bull is officially recognized as both a wild and domestic animal in three countries, Mexico, the USA, and Canada. The American bison would be almost indistinguishable from the bison were it not for the low-set head and thick, tangled mane, which comes over the eyes and forms a characteristic shaggy beard on the chin. Since the American bison were exterminated before it was studied, it is difficult to discover its life. It is known, for example, that bison used to live in huge communities of up to 20,000 animals. The modern bison keep in small herds, not exceeding 20 to 30 animals. There are reports that bulls and cows with calves create separate groups, as they say, based on gender. There is also a controversial issue about the herd hierarchy. Some zoologists claim that the most experienced cow rules the herd, and others are sure that the group is guarded by several old bulls. Bison, especially young ones, are extremely curious. Every new or unfamiliar object grabs their attention. Adults protect the youngsters, who are prone to moving games in the open air, in every possible way. Bison have a highly developed sense of smell, which helps them to smell an enemy at a distance of up to 2 kilometers and a body of water at a distance of up to 8 kilometers. Hearing and eyesight are not as sharp, but they are excellent. One look at a bison is enough to estimate its potential strength, which doubles when it is wounded or cornered. In such a situation, the bison, which is not vicious by nature, quickly becomes irritated, preferring to attack to flee. A sign of extreme agitation is the upright tail and a sharp, from a distance musky odor. The animals often use their voices, mooing or grunting in different tones, especially when the herd is on the move. Several centuries ago, both subspecies of bison, the total population of which reached 60 million animals, were found practically all over North America. Now the range, due to the senseless extermination of the species, ended by 1891, narrowed to a few regions west and north of Missouri. It has been established that long ago bison had a habitual nomadic life, heading south in anticipation of cold weather and returning from there with the onset of warmth. Nowadays, long-distance migration of bison is impossible, as the limits of their habitat are limited to national parks, which are surrounded by farmland. Bison choose different landscapes to live in, including sparse forests, as well as forests, closed in one way or another. Bison graze in the morning and evening, sometimes feeding during the day and even at night. Step bison feed on grass, foraging up to 25 kilograms a day, and switch to grass rags in winter. Forest dwellers, along with grass, diversify their diet with other vegetation. Once a day, animals go to the waterhole, changing this habit only in severe frosts, when water bodies are frozen and bison have to eat snow.